Hey, thanks for uh, stopping by downknowhow.com. It is Tuesday, September 13th, and this is Rob Greaves, and it is a pretty good day today. So the Dow, everything was up today. Everything looked good. Um, we are, as you can see on your screen now, on Twitter. Not much of a presence, but we're getting there. We're just posting everything over there so people on Twitter can see it too. Um, we are on Dig. We've got on Dig. Dig's been having some problems with their uh, their um, system, so we are trying to figure that one out also. Right now, it's, it's issue on Dig's end, so um, we're working on that one. Um, there was a thing called Delicious here. We're on that, so I guess um, that one I still have to figure out, but somehow we ended up on that. We have down now down no house network on delicious. I think that's part of dig. I don't know. I'll have to figure that one out. Anyway, so that stuff I'll just have to get to the bottom of and give you a little heads up on that when we uh, figure that all out. Okay, so today let's take a look at the markets and look at the Dow. It was up uh, um, twenty eight points, not much. Point one point three one percent. So, not too bad. Wait a minute, that's NASDAQ. What am I looking at here? Somehow we got, oh, you know what? I lost my, somehow I lost my Dow. Didn't think that sounded right. Let's take a look at the Dow here, see what it did. Okay, that looks more like it. 44 points on the Dow and less than half a percent increase. Okay, so... Um, in an SPX, we have a three-quarter percent increase here, went up 10, 10 points, 10 and a half points. But, hey, it's positive. So we'll wait and see what Nikki does tonight, and we'll see how we fare. Okay, so you want to know how you, you see this figure up here, how you make 20% return in one day. Uh, let's take a look. I'm just going to run through these real quick, and that's all I'm going to give you. And then um, I'm going to uh, put out, just start uh, picking more of these that are going up in different uh, various ranges and I'll probably put those in the member section for you guys so if you want some of the hot picks and uh, get into the member section and take a look their membership is still free just register it's real simple it's real quick you just register it shoot you an email you go from that email and confirm it and you're in so uh, you can go into the membership section and get some of these and uh, if you have a price range preference then that's fine. Let me know, and I'll find some in your price range. Um, also, I have a, a question out on uh, Facebook right now asking what the preferred price range is for the stock. So we'll see what comes out of that as well. Okay, so how do we make 20% in one day? By going through our 10 stocks for under 2 bucks, and let's take a look at what we got here. Okay, so OPWV, uh, 4.5% increase today. Not bad, okay? That's a pretty good increase, um, and it actually went higher, but it pulled back. So um, CNET, 3.33% uh, increase, and um, it looks like it's going to, it's pretty solidly maybe on the rise. I hope this thing, you know, it's just kind of moving sideways, but it's making one heck of a flag formation here. So what are we what are we looking for in a flag formation? Well, we have the pole here, and then we have the beautiful flag right here. This is a perfect flag formation, by the way. Um, and then what we're looking for uh, is a jump out and up. And so we want to see that jump outside of this. And you know, it's flag formations aren't that. Um, uh, they aren't that trustworthy. You got to look for other things along with it. But we do have, we are sitting pretty good here. So, um, and you know, we are getting this upward trending uh, feeling right here. So we're looking good there. But you know, over here we also had a really nice flag, and we did get the jump out, but it just didn't rise that much. So let's hopefully, let's hopefully hope we get a, a little bit of a change here on this one, and we'll see what happens with this. Keeping an eye on this one. Still looking good. Still thinking it's going to go somewhere hanging in there on that one. So that was a 3.33% gain. 
Okay, here on ENMD, Entree Med, um, we do have another flag formation starting up here, but we got a negative day, 2.34%, uh, still flat, not much of a change, 0 0.04. Got a little loss on that one today, not much. Um, SMTX, we got a 1.29% increase, and we are... Uh, another flag formation right here, and I say this thing's going to close this gap. This thing's going to jump and run pretty quick. I just no other way. I just don't think if we get a good positive day, this thing's got to go up. Okay, DRL, uh, we had a uh, 0 0.76, three quarter percent uh, return here today. Um, it's still looking good to me. You could have a flag formation here. I don't know if that is. It's almost a bit of a jump out of it, and we'll wait and see. Still hanging on to that one. Think it's going to go. Um, BRD a six percent gain today. Look at that. A nice, nice jump on BRD. Really nice uh, gain, and um, just that thing. I think is going to continue to head on up. Don't see any reason for it to drop yet. Starting to approach overbought. Uh, but we'll keep an eye on that one. Okay, EGI, a 4% gain, a nice jump today. Again, starting to approach overbought, starting to top out up here. We'll chart these out in a bit. This still got good momentum. Um, we're still looking good on that one. Uh, SBCF, it had a little bit of a negative drop here, but I'm not sure which way this one's going. We're just going to hang into this one here and because I think it's going to pop back up to the upside. So we're watching that one. Okay, and then 1.84 gain on uh, PLM. And uh, this one looks like it's probably going to take another jump up. I think uh, we got a little bit of ways to go on this one. So we're still looking good on that one. And MGN really didn't do much today, although it did go positive. So it's just 0, 0, 0 sitting at positive. It didn't gain anything, didn't lose anything. But we did get a white marker, so that that's, that's okay. I'll take that. So we got another flag formation here waiting for that jump up, and that's the way we're looking. So, okay, so all said and done, if we move this little guy out of the way here, 4.55% gain on OPW, 3.33 on CNET. We lost a little on EMD. Um, SMTX, 1.29% gain. DRL was a three-quarter percent gain. Uh, PRD is 606% gain. Um, 4.02% gain on EGI, 0.69 on SBF, 1.84 on PLM for a total of a 20% gain. What do you think about that? 20.2. For the day, not bad. You want to know how you take that in half and make it less than half of a gain let me show you let me show you how to do that you take and you remove this and you add in the ones we kicked out we had CIIC gained 1.92 GRO gained 1.82 AMCF gained negative 687 SUTR gained negative 896 for a loss of 12.09 cutting your fantastic day's gain down to 8.11 so that's how you lose money by asking me if you can add those back in your portfolio at which point I say sure why not don't pay attention to me I can't tell you what to do with your money, but here it is. That was a one point, just so you don't think I'm fibbing to you or something. Let me let me see if I can move this aside for you so you can see. Okay, so there is a uh, there's the one point nine two right here for today. Uh, GRO uh, was a one point eight two. There it is right here, one point eight two. Uh, AMCF was a negative 6.87 and there you go and then uh, SUTR was a negative 8.96 and there it is for a total of a 12 point plus gain loss for the day 
And just one last thing before I go, uh, silver, it did jump up a little bit, 1.89%, and um, we'll see where this one goes. It just kind of keeps jumping, falling, jumping, and climbing, and, and keeps that uh, seesaw pattern going. But for right now, looks like it's doing pretty good, and uh, did have a little bit of a gain today, so I'm very happy with today's results. Um, and we will continue to monitor these, and I'm going to throw some more stuff out there for you. Uh, like I said, in the member section, uh, until we're done with this, and then when we're done with this, we'll pick another 10 in another price range, or maybe even this price range. Don't know. We'll see what happens, and we'll just keep monitoring this one until we get a point where we decide to cut it loose and capture our gain and and um, uh, and uh, head on down to the sunset on, on these stocks here. They'll start. They'll start turning over. They'll start. They'll jump or fall or whatever, and we'll start kicking them out. All right. So that's all I got for you today. Uh, thanks for uh, taking a moment to stop by and watch this. And um, we will see you maybe tomorrow if the market goes wild. But uh, unless it doesn't, uh, within probably uh, maybe the day after tomorrow or something. But anyway, take care. Have a good rest of the day. Thanks for stopping by. What you want? What you want? What you want? What you want?